Yo, what is up guys? It is William back here with another video. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys six box you didn't know were in a Minecraft Bedrock Edition. But yeah, let's get into it. Alright guys, uh, so yeah, here we have the chest and this is all of the items, all of the blocks, well, all the items and blocks that you probably didn't know were in Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So yeah, we'll take them all out. And yeah, first up we have the bubble. So you can see it's called tile bubble underscore column dot name. Uh, you can't break it, you can't stand on it, all you can hear is the block being placed. You can see on my item bar, it is actually animated, but when you hold it, it isn't. Uh, yeah, that's quite a simple one. I don't know when it was added though, um, but yeah. Next up guys, we have the stone cutter. Now you may be thinking, oh, that's this stone cutter that was recently added. But actually they added this one in experimental gameplay they didn't add this one though this was added in experimental gameplay when the after the not the aquatic one the one after the aquatic uh but yeah it was added then but they decided to change it and make it animated uh and if you right click this one it wouldn't let you go into it but if you do this one it does uh so yeah that's pretty cool Shows you one that's no longer available. Uh, next up, we have invisible bedrock. So, if you if I place this down, you can see it looks like stone. But if I place it down, it's invisible. It's like a block. But if I try and break it, it just breaks grass, and I'm floating. See, look, look, I'm flying right now. No, I'm not flying, and I'm just stuck in the air, and I'm jumping. But it's not doing anything. See, so yeah, it's impossible to break it, so I wouldn't try putting it down anywhere. Uh, but yeah, that's that. Next up, we have next up we have the end gateway, which is quite a cool, you know, like when you hold it, what it looks like. But if you place this down, uh, it's got like it's like a beacon with a purple uh, line going up, uh, like that. Um, and then it's just got the end texture from like space. And like if you put a bunch of these down it looks pretty sick like that uh but yeah that's the end gateway next up guys we have the glowing obsidian now this one i think looks way better than the other obsidian because it's like glowing red and red is my favorite color uh, yeah, but type in the comments which one you think is better. I think the going obsidian is. If you think it is, tell me in the comments. If you think the black one's better, tell me that. Uh, but I'm pretty sure this comes with a new reactor core, a way to activate something. Uh, but yeah, it doesn't do much. But yeah, there's another obsidian. Next up, guys, we have the nether reactor core. Now, this block was removed, but it was used to create this big tower made from netherrack and that tower would have um zombie pigment in it and then you'll be able to get some loot if you created uh the certain thing uh but yeah that that's actually all of the blocks um yeah thanks to whoever created this i actually don't have the name sadly uh but if you guys want this for yourself, you can use all of these blocks. Go into the description below and there will be a download link to this add-on uh, where you get all of these blocks. But you actually have to kill certain things to get these blocks. I know one of them is the zombie pigment. Yeah, so if you kill this, you get uh, these two items. Uh, but yeah guys, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe. It was quite a short video, but useful. 
I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.